Hey coach, welcome back to the channel. If you haven't yet, make sure you subscribe to stay up to date with all the latest content we put out. At this point, we've pretty much got content going out every 24 to 48 hours. So make sure you subscribe to the channel so you don't stay stuck with your business. Now, if you want to get in contact with me to discuss your business, right, to talk about it, I can show you some actionable steps you can take this week to, to grow and scale. If you want to do that, then jump on a free uh, 15 uh, to 20 minute call with me. Visit the description in this uh, video. There'll be a Calendly link. You can book a free 15 to 20 minute call with me. If not, you can send me a direct uh, message to my email address, which is makemoneycoachingsports at gmail.com. Right, I make it a mission every single day to, to answer uh, questions and respond to coaches. So today I want to talk about how to help your clients get recruited for college scholarships. Now, essentially what I'm going to talk about today is how you can, as a business owner, uh, create a college scholarship program where you're helping uh, the clients that you work with, either one-on-one -on -one or, or in small groups, get recruited for, for to play at college level. Okay. Now, this is something we have helped coaches in our program to, to create. But I want to be completely clear that if you are thinking of going down this, this route and creating something similar in your business, right, the most important thing is that you need to have experience within this field. Right? There's a lot of coaches that want to offer this as part of a, an, extra, an extra service within their business but they've never had any results with, with clients doing it, okay? So you, number one, I would, I would make sure that you're well connected within the um, college space, so you have a lot of contacts with college coaches. And number two, make sure that you have experience getting actual clients recruited into colleges, okay? Because it's very difficult, right? And also you're playing with the emotions of, of the families you work with. Because okay, parents, if they're going to pay a lot of money in your program, they expect you to get them results. Okay, so make sure you're connected in the college space, right? You've got college contacts with coaches. And also make sure you've got previous experience getting clients air recruited. Right, so I'm going to share with you six, pretty much six tips on how you can implement a college program into your into your training service okay and different ways that you can help your clients to get recruited now you can there's two ways you can go about it you can create an actual uh, program which you work with a client specifically on this right there's no training involved right you're specifically working uh, and consulting with a client helping them to get recruited or Right, you can create a service where you're training and you're doing the recruiting side. Okay, so there's some coaches that just do the consulting, where that's all they do. There's other coaches that that create a, a program where there's training and there's a there's a college a scholarship in there as well. Okay, so essentially you're helping clients to get recruited into college. Okay, now the first thing I would recommend if you want to start any any type of program like this you need to build a list of your local colleges that you want to work with and you want to recommend to the clients you work with okay so what i would recommend is i would start local so lo start locally with colleges in your city in your local area okay get in contact with them and ask them what types of players they're looking for what do they look for when they recruit Okay, and build relationships with those local colleges. Okay, so that way, any player or athlete, families that come to work with you, okay, you can directly say to them, right, this is what this college is looking for. This is what this college is looking for, right? So you need to become an expert in this niche and in this field. Right, the second one, attend college ID camps and showcases. Right, so whatever sport you're in, if it's in soccer, if it's in basketball, okay, whatever sport it is, right, 
one thing you can do is you can help your clients to stay up to date with the latest uh, college ID camps and uh, college so showcases. Right, so the camps are essentially more uh, training. Okay, so they might be one day camps, they might be two day camps, they might be three day camps, right? It depends on the college. But you as the expert, you as the business owner, need to be up to date with which are the latest um, college camps, ID camps in the local area. So that way you can recommend them to the clients you work with and you can push them towards uh, attending them and getting in front of college coaches. Okay, now college showcases are a little bit more different. They're more, the, the way I've seen it in the past is they're more matches so players will attend play an 11 v 11 uh, game and then essentially coaches what they do is they they pick out the best players from from that match and then they'll, they'll get in contact with parents and and so forth okay so the third one is reach out to college coaches yourself okay so the first one was build a list of local colleges Right now, the third one is actually get in contact for, to with the coaches at those colleges. So, best way to do it, right? Number one, you can actually visit the college yourself, right? Number two, you can get in contact with them in through platforms such as LinkedIn is a very common one. Okay, and essentially, why you want to do this is because you want to build a relationship with those co those coaches that. It gets to a point where those coaches can reach out to you and they ask you, right, Leo, I'm looking for a, for a striker. I'm looking for a winger. Do, can you recommend anyone to me? Okay. Co college coaches are constantly looking to recruit players into their program. And if they see you as an expert, if they see you as, as someone that has a lot of influence over, over kids, over clients in, in that local area, that local city, then they'll come to you and you can essentially set up a, a type of referral program where if you get players into their program, right, you can get a referral fee either from the college itself or through the parent by helping them to get recruited into the college. Okay. So again, if you need more help on this, get in contact with me. We have been doing this with coaches. We've helped coaches to, to create really successful programs in all sports, right? In soccer, in football, in basketball, you know, whichever sport you, you can think of, we've worked with coaches and we've advised coaches on creating a similar program uh, with their business. Right, now the, the fourth one, and this is something you can create separately, okay, there's some coaches that create an actual, you know, three, six, 12 month program, which is solely based on getting the, um, getting their, their athletes uh, recruited to a college. There's other coaches that offer uh, highlight videos as an extra service. So essentially the parent comes to you, they, they pay you a fee, right? And you go out, you, you record the, mat, the, the game that the, the child is playing for, for their team. And then you edit the video to make it look... Um, appealing to make it you know and it has all their specific highlights uh, strengths weaknesses so that you can send that video footage back to the parent and then they can use it to send uh, to upload on on their college air uh, profile okay so that's an extra service you can you can offer parents right so highlight video editing where parents Essentially, there's two ways you can do it. Parents record the video and send it to you. You edit it. Or you can actually go out to, to, to watch your clients play, record the game, and then edit it in your own time. Right? This is a very common um, service. It's a, it's a service that does take a lot of time. Right? Editing is not an easy process. It takes a lot of time. It takes a lot of effort, a lot of energy. Right, so it's a service that if you do really well, okay, you can ultimately charge a premium for your service, right? And parents will pay if it's getting results and it looks really, really good um, edited.
Okay. Now the fifth one is creating an athlete social media account. So this is again, another service some coaches offer. So parents will come to coaches and say, right, I need my son to build my son or daughter. I want them to build a, a social media account where, you know, we're reaching out to coaches through social media or it looks really, really appealing. And any college coaches who, you know, come across their page, want to reach out to them to invite them into a college showcase, etc. Right. So some coaches, what they do is they offer this as a service as well. So creating an athlete social media account where they upload a footage of the player playing, right? They, you know, the player as well sends them a footage of them working out every single day. Right. So essentially what you do is you create a journey through their social media account that any college coach that comes across can see what is the day to day of this player. What are they like as a person? Right? What habits? How do they play in a, in a game situation? Right. And it's attractive. It's attractive to coaches. And essentially, if it's done really well, it can get um interest from coaches right so this is this is something you can offer parents as well to create and manage their social media account so that you can as a coach you can send that social media account to college coaches and college coaches can then watch the journey of the player and if it's something that interests them right they can reach out to you and you can you guys can schedule a meeting or schedule to send them to an ID camp or a showcase, etc. So get them in front of that college coach to hopefully then get get recruited to play at, at college. Right. And essentially the sixth one, and this is this is not a strategy, but it's more a recommendation is to make sure that you start the recruiting process early. So as a business owner, you don't want to promise uh, parents and clients something that then you're not going to deliver okay so essentially what you want to do is you want to make sure that any any college process that you're going through with your clients whatever you're helping them with whether it be highlight videos whether it be getting them into id camps or college showcases uh, creating highlight videos for them right or managing their social media you want to make sure that you start it early enough so that OK, you, you, you have enough time in order to get them recruited, OK, because you can imagine for every one college place, there's probably going to be about 20, 30 or 50 kids in that local area that want that college place. Right. Whatever sport it is. So you have to make sure that you get in there early and you're doing the right things as a business owner. OK, and as a as a as a trainer to get your, your client the best success possible, right? Now, if you're leaving it last minute, then the chances are, you know, some of the spots at those college programs will get taken up very quickly, okay? So you want to act quickly. You want to start the process early so that you have enough time to offer different types of service and help your clients to get as much success as possible, All right? So if you need more help with this, okay, these are just, Five different ways that you can essentially get in front of, of coaches and you can also offer your services to clients, to parents, to families. So you can help their child to get recruited to play at college and essentially you can charge a fee in order to in, in for helping them to achieve that goal. OK, so essentially it was five. But also the, the sixth was a recommendation, which is, like I say to all coaches, to start early. OK, if you need any more help with this, reach out to me two ways. Go onto my Calendly link, book a call with me. If not, then you can you can send me an email to make money coaching sports. Right. Thank you for watching and I'll see you.